When it comes to personal defense, choosing the right firearm is crucial. Pocket pistols are a popular choice for those who prioritize concealment and convenience, but not all pocket pistols are created equal. In this video, we will explore some of the best pocket pistols for personal defense. From the popular and reliable Glock 43 to the innovative and customizable Sig Sauer P365, there are plenty of options to fit your needs and preferences. Whether you are a seasoned gun owner or a first-time buyer, this guide will provide valuable insight into some of the top pocket pistols on the market. Walther PK The Walther PPK is a well-known firearm that requires no introduction. It was famously used as the signature sidearm by the fictional British spy, James Bond, in numerous books, films, and video games. The PPK model chosen for Bond's use was chambered in 7.65mm Browning, which is equivalent to the 32 ACP in the United States. However, Walther has also introduced improved versions of the PPK, chambered in 380 ACP, which are better suited for personal defense. Despite being a classic design, the PPK has some disadvantages. Its all-steel construction makes it relatively heavy for its size, but this added weight makes it more comfortable to shoot. Additionally, the pistol can be finicky when it comes to ammunition selection, so it's important for owners to thoroughly test any defensive ammunition in the gun before relying on it for personal defense. Taurus Curve the Taurus Curve is a firearm with a distinct feature. It has a curved shape that conforms to the natural contours of the body. This makes it an ideal choice for those who want a pistol that is easy to carry. However, experienced gun owners may find the unconventional shape of the pistol grip unfamiliar and distracting. Unlike most pistols, the curve does not have any iron sights. Instead, the user aims the gun by looking through the back of the slide. The barrel of the pistol is also curved to match the rounded slide, allowing for a smooth return to a holstered position against the body. However, this also means that the end of the barrel is not rifled. It's important to note that the curve is not a firearm designed for both range use and personal defense. Its unique design is specifically intended for concealed carry purposes. The pistol has a standard 6 plus 1 payload, which is sufficient for defending against threats. Users should be aware of the unconventional safeties and practice clearing, loading, and shooting the pistol accordingly. Ruger LCP-2 The Ruger LCP-2 is a pistol that boasts a great balance between ergonomics and functionality. Its iron sights are of a subtle size and its curved design allows for smooth handling, making this firearm both reliable and durable. The most striking feature of the LCP-2 is its size. It is smaller than most subcompact pistols, making it an ideal choice for pocket concealment. Although minor issues with any concealed carry firearm can be expected, the LCP2's small size overcomes any discomfort. This pistol has become increasingly popular, with almost every gun shop carrying it due to its practicality and affordability. The LCPD is reasonably priced, making it accessible to the average consumer and Ruger still offers its original LCP model at a reduced MSRP of $400. Sig Sauer P290RS The Sig Sauer P290RS is a welcomed addition to Sig's personal defense lineup, offering a pocket pistol to complement the company's larger personal defense guns. The pistol's modern ergonomics strike a balance between smooth curves and hard-angled features that aid in its operation but could potentially hinder smooth draws and reholstering. With a 9mm chambering and a distinctive bell-shaped tip on the barrel, this pocket pistol offers increased power and accuracy. The P290RS has a solid 1-inch wide slide, giving it a similar feel to a full-size pistol for those who prefer some heft in a compact or subcompact firearm. However, individuals with larger hands may find the grip to be a drawback and may need to use alternate grip panels or an extended magazine. Additionally, the P290RS can be expensive, which may be a deterrent for some potential buyers. Nevertheless, the pistol's quality and feature-rich design more than make up for its price. Smith & Wesson M and P Bodyguard 380 A reliable addition to Smith & Wesson's M and P line. 
The Bodyguard 380 is a solid and compact pocket pistol that doesn't sacrifice performance for style. As its name suggests, the Bodyguard is purpose-built for personal defense and can confidently face threats. However, some carriers may find the assembly and disassembly of the pistol to be occasionally frustrating. Additionally, the trigger may break late, although aftermarket modifications are available to address this issue. Owners should be aware of these potential frustrations and practice accordingly. Compared to the CAR CT380, the bodyguard is a similar size and slightly larger than the LCP, but appears small compared to the Glock 42. While the pistol may not be comfortable in larger hands, it makes for an excellent pocket carry. Despite its size, the bodyguard is a fairly accurate pistol in the hands of a steady shooter. Sig Sauer P365 SAS The Sig Sauer P365 SAS sits between a pocket pistol and a standard subcompact, and its slightly larger size may make it a better fit for pocket carry. The SAS model is designed with anti-snag features such as trim slide release, cut-off sights, and a takedown lever that requires a flat head tool. SIG offers a variety of magazine options, and the flush-fitting 10-round magazine is ideal for pocket carry. Sacrificing the pinky rest helps to keep the gun small, but the P365 is still relatively soft shooting and durable. The SAS model features unique flush-fit sights that increase concealment but require practice to master. The ported barrel and slide help to reduce muzzle rise and maintain a sight picture, improving control. The P365 is one of the best overall concealed carry pistols out there. The SAS model makes it pocket-friendly. Beretta Pico The Beretta Pico is a remarkable firearm that was specifically designed for deep carry and complete concealment. Beretta made extensive modifications to the Pico, resembling the SAS configurations, by trimming, cutting, and slimming down the firearm as much as possible. To ensure a snag-free experience while carrying the Pico in your pocket, Beretta made sure that the slide release, magazine release, and takedown lever were flush with the frame. Nevertheless, swapping magazines and dropping the slide can be a bit challenging, but this is not a major concern for most people carrying pocket pistols, as reloading is not often necessary. As a Beretta, the Pico boasts a reputation for reliability, accuracy, and superior craftsmanship. It is an outstanding choice for concealed carry and is often overlooked among other Mini 380s. One interesting feature of the Peco is that users have the ability to remove the chassis and swap the grip frame to change the color of the firearm. Glock Key 43 The Glock Key 43 is a late arrival to the single-stack 9mm market, but Glock made sure to do it right. Although it barely fits the pocket pistol category, the D43 is relatively lightweight and thin, standing at 4.25 inches tall with the magazine and 6.26 inches long. Despite its six-round magazine capacity, the D43 is reliable and easy to handle for those familiar with the Glock trigger. The sights are large and replaceable, and the gun is simple and durable like all Glocks. In terms of shooting experience, the D43 has some recoil and snap, but it's not uncomfortable to shoot. Additionally, the ergonomics are typical of a Glock, with controls that are easily recognizable to anyone familiar with the brand. Overall, the Glock Key 43 is a reliable and capable firearm that can withstand harsh conditions, making it an ideal choice for concealed carry.